Growing children, growing needs. We can measure a tiny baby born no bigger than the size of a cup of coffee. We can measure the time it takes her family to travel to the hospital. But how can you measure a parent's anxiety when their child is sick? How can we measure the future possibilities held in the life of every child? I'm Sue Carruthers, President of BC Children's Hospital Foundation. I'd like to personally introduce you to the work we do here at the hospital and throughout BC. I'd also like to introduce you to Joanne and Shane Harashka. They rely on the specialized care at BC Children's Hospital every year. Actually, my water broke um, at 25 weeks gestation and um, we were um, air flighted down to Children's and um, Ladicia was born a week later um, at a pound and a half, um, severely premature. You just knew you were in the best place that you could be with your child in, in her condition. Today, Ladicia is growing faster than anyone imagined. At two and a half years, her height and weight are just what they should be. While it's easy to measure little Ladicia's progress in pounds and inches, we'll never be able to measure the pure joy and relief of her family. Because they live in Prince George, their visits to BC Children's Hospital are a time-consuming and costly venture. In fact, 67% of all children who need the specialized treatment and care at BC Children's Hospital live outside the city of Vancouver. Distances that measure hundreds of miles and some as many as eight hours away. We hope to increase our reach across the province in order to give these children the support and care they need, not just when they visit us here at the hospital, but locally in their own communities through the specialized support that only Child Health BC can provide. Child Health BC is aimed at ensuring every child and youth has easier access to specialized pediatric care, no matter where they live in this province. This is needed because there are one million children and youth in British Columbia spread over a landmass larger than the states of Washington, Oregon, and California combined. Many of them must travel a long distance to BC Children's Hospital when they need ongoing specialized treatment. One way to achieve this is by sending Children's Hospital's health professionals on the road. This is something the hospital is already doing, but we want to do a lot more of it. And as Dr. Peterson and the Harushkas can attest, we can measure just how many families there are in BC that need your support right now. We can measure one more thing, just how far your contribution will go to help all of the sick and injured children who need us. Your gift of $5,000 today, which I know is a greater amount than you may have given before, will give children like Ladicia the highest level of pediatric care no matter where they live. By helping us to raise $50 million to expand the Child Health BC program, you will help us reach every corner of the province. We want to see children grow up and measure their own success, not just in inches, but in dreams for the future. Your financial support has never been more important than it is right now. With the help of Children's, it put us to the point where we had a fighting chance to keep her alive. And they did everything they could, and we have our miracle here. And I mean, personally, we owe everything to them. Your gift today will make thousands of futures possible all across BC. Please give as generously as you can with our deepest thanks. Thank you.